Hey, Sam. Let's jump over here. Let's see what... Uh... I disagree. I think your sketches are super effective. Um, time constraints, we all get that, definitely. Okay, good good ideas, good thoughts. Um, let's talk about the, 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 the connective um, elements, the, what you're going to use to connect the, the narrative. And it's great that you're thinking. That's great foresight, showing, you know, the, how you plan on moving forward from here and defining that, connecting the... Um, story is is definitely showing your uh, ability to define a problem before it arises. So that I thought I was I was very impressed with that. So let's go ahead and jump right in. Okay, I think the as I said the sketches are great. I mean this is you can't expect more from sketches than this. You just can't. I mean the, it clearly expresses your idea, and that's all we're looking for in sketches okay so as a, as a designer you don't have to be a great sketch artist you just have to be able to communicate your idea to me it looks like you are a great sketch artist so that's fantastic right um all right so the, the I, I see six of eight frames i see eight frames now if you remember in my introduction to the assignment i recommended 10 to 12 frames i still leaning towards 12 i think it's going to create the most interesting narrative i'll describe why in one Actually, I'll describe why right now. Once you break these out of their individual cells, you, you, the eight frames might be a little bit brief. Then you'll start to find that out when you start to assemble this and decide how you're going to connect these once you break them out of their individual uh, frames, so to speak. Okay, great for storyboarding. It really is a great way to organize your thoughts and organize your ideas and organize your visual depiction of the communicated, uh, the idea to be communicated. However, it's not always the best idea in terms of presentation. So we'll break these out of their squares and somehow give them an organic relationship to one another. And I think that, you know, I, I think cracked eggshells would be a great way to connect the, the illustrations. I think cracked eggshells would be a perfect way. Um, okay, so we've got ingredients. Right? Then we've got further definement of the ingredients. So we got the mixing the ingredients, kneading the dough. I think it's called kneading. Kneading, isn't that right? And then, okay, darn it, I don't have a rolling pin. I think a frame in between these two, where instead of going from problem to solution, you go from problem to a really perplexing look on her face, like, or even, I'm going to use this overused example, but it is effective. So you go from the scratching my head going, oh no, I don't have a rolling pin, to what am I going to do now? Then to, aha, a bottle of wine. Okay, so, so there's a, a little bit of information in between these two that's saying, oh, what am I going to do? And I think that's the defining, that's the kind of transition story where she gets this perplexed look on her face, seemingly running into a dead end, and then all of a sudden, aha, I have an idea. Okay, does that make sense? Now, that'll come. And, and you try to add a, a one or two more frames in here just for visual interest. Okay, so... Uh, maybe, um, boy, I don't know. I don't know. Think about that, right? So then you have the wine bottle, definitely. And I want to introduce this wine bottle later on in, in the narrative, too. I think that would create some interesting connections. So, okay, so we got the dough. You know, the, the dough's being rolled out. The dough's flat, ready for the cookie press. Yes, okay, we have finished cookies. Maybe you could add another frame where there's a plate of finished cookies, then an open bottle of wine with a, a, a wine glass next to it, indicating that, okay, I'm done with the cookies. I think I'm going to enjoy a glass of wine. Do you see what I'm saying? Um, that might be a really super interesting way to end, end the, the narrative. And it would also be really interesting because you're drawing connections from portions of in the middle of the story to the end of the story. And that, as you know, from storytelling techniques is a very, very effective technique. Okay, great job, fantastic job. Um, uh, if you have any questions, let me know. If you, you, you want to run something by me, please let me know. I'll be glad to clarify or be glad to address anything that comes up. But uh, really, really satisfied, really pleased with this. Looking forward to seeing uh, this go to the digital stage. Great job, thank you.